Welcome again. Today we have an exponential challenge. The question is 3 to the power of x plus 3 to the power of x equal to 5. What well, will be the value of x? Okay, how do we solve this uh, challenge? It's a very simple one, but let's put down our solution and see the approach we can use to solve this. Okay, so we'll take our solution. We put down the question, which is 3 to the power of x plus 3 to the power of x again equal to 5. Now, number one thing we're going to do here is to factor out 3 to the power of x because we are having 3 to the power of x here, 3 to the power of x here. So let's go ahead and factor out 3 to the power of x. If we do that, we're going to have here 3 to the power of x bracket. Here we're left with 1 plus, here we're also left with 1, close bracket, equal to 5. So automatically we have 2 into 3 to the power of x equal to 5. Easy. Okay. Yeah, we're looking for x. And so the first thing to do here is to eliminate this uh, constant, 2. So by dividing through by 2. So if we divide both sides of the equation by 2, we're going to have this to be this all over 2 and this all over 2. Of course, this will go with this. Okay? So here, we are now left with 3 to the power of x equal to 5 all over 2 on the left-hand side of the equation. Yeah. For us to get our x here, we can take the ln of both sides, which is the natural log to base e of both sides. But here, let's take log to base 10 of both sides. Okay? So if we take log to base 10 of both sides, this now implies your log 3 bracket 3 out to the power of x. Okay? Base 10 equal to log. 5 all over 2 base 10. Let's proceed on this other side. Okay. Now, according to the law of logarithm, we move this power backward. Okay. So if we move this power here from law of logarithm, we take this backward. And also we have the division law of logarithm. Okay. Which says that if you have log m slash n, that's n divided by n. This will give us leg m minus leg n. So if we succumb to this rule and this power rule, the whole of this equation cannot be written as our x leg, we're left with 3 here. So 3 base 10 equal to on this side, we're going to have leg, so we have here leg 5, okay, base 10 minus leg 2, base 10. Okay, now we want to divide through by log 3 base 10 to get our x because that is the aim of the whole thing. So we have here leg divided by log 3, so base 10, all over log 3 base 10. Of course, the left-hand side of the equation, this and this will leave, we are left with x. So we now have x equal to log 5 base 10 minus log 2 base 10 all over log 3 base 10. So from here, we have our x equal to the log of 5 base 10 from our calculator. We give us 0 0.6990 minus, which is our minus sign, log 2 base 10. We give us 0 0.3010 all over log 3 base um, 10. We give us 0 0.4771. Okay, so let's go ahead and subtract the numerator. So we have our x 
equal to so if we subtract this we're going to come out with our zero point um, six nine eight all over the denominator remains four seven seven one okay and so therefore we can get our x if we divide this by this to be zero point four two okay so this is the value for our x all right yeah but i want to check if the value to the x will suffer correspond or gives us the right solution to this exponential equation by substituting this answer into the initial equation because i've uh, made it a point of duty to be checking all my um, answers in all my challenges these days okay for confirmation all right so let's check if this answer will satisfy this equation so from here we'll proceed from here let's proceed to check from here we all have check let's check we put down our equation which is we have 3 to the power of x plus 3 to the power of x equal to 5. yeah so wherever we see um, x we put in this value so this will now give us 3 to the power of 0 point your 8 3 4 2 plus 3 to the power of 0 point 8 3 4 2 everything equal to 5. okay now at this point let's resolve to our calculator what is 3 to the power of 0 0.8342. Uh, yeah, we have 2.5000. So this, yeah, we have 2.500 plus this will give us same 2.500 equal to 5. So if we add this together, automatically this will give us 5.00, which is equal to 5. So this now implies that 5 is equal to 5. It's correct. So it shows that our root to uh, this exponential, so it shows that the answer of x to the exponential equation is correct. All right, so this is online mass TV. This is what I have for you for today. Okay, if you have a better way of solving this simple exponential challenge, leave it in the comment section below. If you learned something from this video thus far, also give the video a thumbs up. Remember, Jace loves you and all of us at Online Mass TV. Love you. Bye for now.